In this video, I'm gonna show you the settings you need to disable right now on your Windows in order to get a better performance and better FPS with your any low-end PC or laptop. This optimization guide will work for your Windows 10 or 11, whatever you are using, and this will make your PC more responsive and faster for gaming in 2024. So guys, before starting this video, if it's your first time here, please subscribe, drop a like on this video, and with wasting any time, let's dive straight into it. Gear Booster is one of the best programs for the optimization of your ping while you're playing games using your wired or wireless connection. This is the one of the best program for rerouting your network and help you to connecting with the nearest server of the game for achieving the better ping with lower input delay. So guys, make sure to check out the link in the description for downloading this tool and enjoy the free trial using my link in the description. So guys, in the way for step, we are going to configure our Windows configuration settings. So for the press windows are together from your keyboard and you will find out here this is one window now type here gp edit dot msc and press enter now go for computer configuration administrative template windows component and there you will find app privacy so go for this folder inside you will find out multiple settings so scroll down and find less windows app run in the background open up this option now you need to enable the settings on your PC. After that, go for default for all app and set it on to the force deny. After that, hit apply and click OK. Now you need to go back. Go back. Now go for system tab. Scroll down and find out here power management. Go for it. Go for power throttling settings and go for turn off power throttling. You need to enable the settings on your PC for disabling the power throttling. Now hit apply and click OK. Now in the next step, you need to disable the high precision event timer on your Windows in order to get better CPU performance and lower input delay. So guys, simply right click here on your Windows Start icon. After that, go for Device Manager. Now you need to find out your system devices into this list. Go for this drop down. Now find out here high precision event timer. Right click here. Go for disable device. Hit yes and disable high precision event timer on your windows. Now close out device manager. Now in the next step we are going to disable all the unnecessary effects of our windows from our PC. So for that again right click on your windows start icon. Go for system. Open up advanced system settings go for performance settings now here you will find out adjust for best performance so select out here this option and this will disable all the unnecessary animation from your windows and help you to getting better performance now just simply go for show thumbnail instead of icon check mark on this box after that hit apply click ok and save the settings on your windows 10 or 11. so guys now the next step you need to download this windows service optimization pack 2024 on your pc and you can find it from my official website link available down in the description simply go there and download this pack on your pc once you download this zip file right click here and extract it on your desktop after that you will find out here these two folder like windows d bloater and disable unnecessary service to cmp file so open up the first folder for windows d bloat and Inside you will find out for Windows 10 and Windows 11. Choose it according to your PC. I have Windows 11. So go for the folder if you have Windows 10. So go for Windows 10 folder. But guys, settings is almost same. So you need to go for this exe file. So right click here. Go for open button and open up ultimate windows tweaker on your pc so guys here is the interface of the windows ultimate tweaker now the very first step i suggest you to create a restore point on your pc because if you want to revert any settings back to the normal so you can do it so simply go for this option that is create restore point now you need to go for this configuration option and turn off system protection after that hit apply and click ok now you need to go for create button now simply type it ripex and click onto the create button again and create restore point on your pc once you create the restore point now the very first step you need to go for this performance option inside you will find out here the settings so guys you need to simply change the settings like auto and non-responsive program check mark on this box restart shell automatically after some error check mark on this box after that go for disable edge tab preloading check mark on this box now you need to go for this option so here you will find our disable prefer service disable superfast service disable printer spoiling service and disable microsoft preloading so guys check mark on this box after that you need to go for additional settings so guys here we are in the additional settings simply follow these settings here now you need to go for security and privacy tab there you will find out these multiple settings simply skip it go for privacy tab there you will find out these multiple settings so guys check mark onto the disable and reset advertisement id disable telemetry disable handwriting data sharing disable task bing web search disable wi-fi sense 
disable app access to location, disable app to access the camera, and disable all these settings. Now go on the right side, disable sync of all settings. After that, click on the apply button, hit OK, and this will apply these settings on your PC. Now once you have applied these settings, now close out Ultimate Windows Tweaker and hit ok and also guys after applying the settings you need to restart your pc but we are gonna do it later so now here in the next step you will find out here this disable unnecessary service file so right click here and make sure to run this as administrator for having the full access after that here you will find out this kind of the exe file so guys here it will ask you for the permissions simply click here yes press enter after that this will ask you for basic standard and advanced optimization i suggest you simply go with the basic one and press enter after that thanks for using my optimization tool and simply close out this tool so guys now the next step we are going to disable all the unnecessary services from our windows so for the press windows are together from your keyboard and type here ms config and press enter now go for service tab there you will find that hide all microsoft services check my this box and this will hide all the important microsoft service now you need to find out here's unimportant services from this list but guys i don't have any unimportant service in this list but if you have simply guys uncheck that box then hit apply and click ok so guys now the next step we are going to disable some delivery optimization settings of our windows so for that go for your windows start icon open up your windows settings now go for windows update section in the very first step it is always important to update your windows on the latest button so click on the download and install the latest update on your pc after that go for advanced option there you will find our delivery optimization so go for delivery optimization and turn off the settings from your pc after that close out your windows settings now you need to one time reach your pc therefore all the changes take effect after that launch your favorite game and enjoy the best performance out of your pc i hope you love it please make sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel and guys see you in the next video